No? Okay, good. Pachi, pachi. Actually, I can't say it was the pachi because we also did the, you know, in the first few days. I'll be coming yes. you spark that thing. Oh. Just Just you want me to change that again? If you can. Yeah. Okay. So, when some people get their spider things treated with injection, like sick, does that cause spider things? Yeah, they're all broken things. Yeah. Do you think that could cause blood stasis? They inject like a saline or something, or even a laser? Uh, injection. Okay, are the injection saline or inject? I mean, is it true saline? Because if it's saline, I don't care. But if it's anything else, what's the saline supposed to do with the varicosity? Uh, with what? How's the saline supposed to help the varicosity? Uh, it actually shuts down the vein. It collapses the vein. So it's like cauterizing it, basically. It's a different way. It's supposed to be less painful. I don't know. What is it? I don't know. I, I don't know. I was just curious if it's truly saline, I don't care. Yeah. If it's um, if it's anything has any chemical in it, I do care. In which case, I have to treat the liver. And then they also do laser. The laser is literally cauterizing. I mean, that's, I mean uh, that's what I would assume. Um, I don't know. I mean, I don't. I mean, I don't. Wouldn't recommend it to anyone unless it's for uh, if they have really have pain. Right, like a varicose. Yeah, and then we talked about Joy Tanyin. You know, uh, oh, we never really went through the joy points here. Okay, Let, let's start with her, and then we'll we'll see what we can do more. So insomnia and asthma. Well, can you breathe in deeply for me? And out. Again. Okay, now just breathe deeply without effort. You were trying too hard, that's all. Don't stop the breath. <laughs> just breathe. I think inhalation is a little staccato. What, what, when do you feel? What do you feel? When right you feel? now, I don't have. I know muscles. you don't have right now, but when you do. When I do. Is it hard to breathe in or breathe out? By the way, the, that, that concept is not real, but that's. I'll tell you about that. Breathing in seems to be a little more shallow, and it's more always shallow. at night. <clears throat> okay, because I'm hearing a little on the in breath. Mm -hmm. Very, it's very subtle, but um, and not, not so much on the out breath. Um, which puts her in the, into the kidney three category as opposed to the spleen four category. Okay. Uh, asthma is lung five plus either kidney three if it's an inhale or spleen four if it's an exhale problem. Now, this business, I, I just want you to understand there is no such thing. Okay, let's see. Asthma is ultimately always a problem. Well, you can define it either way, but it's only one or the other. It's, there's no in asthma, out asthma. There's only one kind of asthma, which is the diaphragm got stuck. The alveoli, or whatever they're called, the, the balloons in the lungs, can't contract. So the person is going to feel, depending on how you feel it, you may feel, I can't breathe out. Okay, so what you need to do is you need to push the diaphragm and like, contract the damn things. Okay? And then they'll be willing to expand again. Okay? Or the person may feel, I can't breathe in anymore, but they actually, they finish the in-breath. They just, they, ultimately, it's they can't breathe out. All asthmas are they can't breathe out. It's just a question of how it feels to you. Because asthma is defined as you got, you, you got the expansion and it's not willing to contract. Okay? So and that's why it's an autonomic nervous system disorder, because of that elasticity issue. Okay. So, usually for asthma, I don't have bunions, lovely. Mm -hmm. okay. um, for asthma, one, two, three, anything? Two mildly. Two mildly. Okay. One, two, three. Three mildly. Three mildly, two mildly. Okay. Rents 15? No. 17? No. no. Nine, yes. I don't But I feel the comfort. pulse. Okay, but I feel the pulse. Do you, do you see how many people have this? I'm telling you, 15 years ago, almost no one had it. Really? Brand new ones. Because I pop it, you know, I pop it all the time. You know, and so we many. already had, knew about. It wasn't like it's a concept that came. Okay, but so you don't feel. 
No. No. And this Ren 9 palace can be around the navel, tends to be more on the left. Don't, it doesn't have to be exactly Ren 9. Okay? And 12. Okay. So just mild and mild. Mm -hmm. Okay. So again, a big earring. Do you want me to take No, one? no, it's okay. Anything here? Not really. Yes. 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 Okay. Other side. So it wasn't, it, not quite on the end, but around. A little bit here also, right? Uh, a little bit, yeah. Yeah. This one. Uh -huh. Okay. This one, and I believe this one. No. This one? That's this tender. one, this one, this one. Okay. That's onion on both sides? Ah, uh, yeah, we'll call them onion. Okay. Rapid pulse always? Mm -hmm. Okay. And disappears upon pressure. Do you, have, do you sweat? No. And not, not cold mm -hmm. outside? Do you get startled easily? Mm -hmm. Okay. Can you bend this leg for me? Bend the leg. Oh, thank you. Under the third toe? Okay. Hi, how's. Oppo it's opposite side of checking on the end. Doesn't hurt. Okay. Could you bend the other leg for me? Um, and we can you okay. <laughs> How's this side? Doesn't hurt. Great. Okay. This I can do from the back. Okay. Ask that I can't. Okay. Under the third row. Oh, that's yeah, unfortunately, everyone who studied Ukiko is going to have slightly different terminology. I call it under the third point, toe. Uh, some people call it blood pressure point. Okay. And what is your blood pressure, by the way? Usually like 110 or 70. Okay. It's perfectly reasonable. Very nice. <laughs> okay. Number two here, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Lung five. How's now? I don't feel it. Fabulous, but before you don't feel it, feeling it again? Not really. Damn. <laughs> no. It's not really Fine, okay. <laughs> Not really. Oh, and you used to have nasal allergies, is that what you said? Oh, I still do, yeah. Oh, you still do. Okay, fine. Mm -hmm. Hold on. Okay. One. Two, three, four. Um, probably four, mildly. Four, mildly. How's four, mildly? Four, nothing. No. Nothing. Kidney three. Doesn't relate to the nose in any way, shape, or form, but it relates to our asthma. I, you did, I felt possible you didn't feel anything, right? Yeah, no, just kind of part. Yeah, but pass is gone now. Okay. Kidney three, right. good. Nothing left. So lung five, kidney three is basically her asthma thing. And we'll add immune because of nose. One, two, three, four. Four again. Four again. Ah, now this is another injury. If somebody wants to feel her immune points, hold on one second. One, two, three. How's now? Nothing. Nothing. If somebody wants to feel, it's like hollow. Oh. Right? Yeah. Very it's, interesting. It seems. Was the yeah. other side? I haven't checked the other side. Oh, I thought you did. No, no, I haven't. I did the other side I did with kidneys. Oh, that's right. 
Does it mean that she has very low immunity? I don't know. It means it's very interesting. <laughs> it definitely means I want anoxate rather than just needle. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It also means there's probably something in the medical history I haven't figured out yet. Weirdness and when a muscle and a and muscle and a bone sort of separate like this, not a good thing. <laughs> one thing. I mean, related to my lungs, I was you know when they do um, the TB scratch test, I was positive, uh -huh. so I took medication for it. Where were you born? Reno, Nevada. Okay, because I'm also positive. You know, anybody uh, outside the U.S. is going to test positive. You know, big deal. <laughs> so that you know. Okay. I didn't know if that was important. But you tested positive. Yes, it is important. But she took med that's mm -hmm. Because they said you must have TB, and, and because you're an acupuncturist, you work somewhere, and they must, <laughs> you must do. Is that? Uh, yeah, yeah I, this was like 12 years ago, and I took whatever meds it was to be supposedly faster. Um, there are all these, uh, two bucket oh. the needles. No, yeah, I know, I actually prefer the, uh, mm, sorry? Low, not enough sleep lowers the immune system. Yeah, yeah, I understand. Yeah, but I don't know if where did that? Go? Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. No, no, no. Yeah. Okay. So sorry. You okay? Then why did you choose to do under the toe? Autonomic nervous. No, uh, as opposed to. Like you talked about the foundation starting at the feet. Wait, wait, wait. The foundation is... She doesn't have... The foundation is this. Oh, okay. With the asthma... First of all, I did kidney three also. The asthma, I checked lung five and kidney three. Which one do you want to check? Which one do you want to needle first? No big deal. Mm -hmm. it, it really is not. If she had... If there was another reason to do it, I would... You know, th then yes. Okay. So I wanted to start with the asthma first. Mm -hmm. Because it's not... Because, I don't know what's going to happen, but you know there is a possibility that in the middle, if if some spasm happens in the lung, that the whole tree, you know, I want to avoid that possibility first. Then I can treat other things. Asthma is pretty primary. Do you know what I'm saying? Yes. Oxygen is primary. <laughs> I know. But the pulse now is much, much deeper, but still some. Should it disappear? I prefer. No, no, no. I told you, pulse, red nine pulse does not disappear usually. The lessons. Hmm? Now, these points, Mushu, is also can be very. Truth is, trochanter is better, but I can't get, you know. But Mushu is also good for Ren 9, but also good for asthma. Mm -hmm. okay. Chokhatter is better. Okay. Okay, cool. Let me do this nice and easy. Okay. Anything here? Yes. Oh, that, yeah. was that was. Oh, that was. Okay. I'm around UB 43, so I'm, I'm between the scapulas somewhere. Okay, so lung reflex. Okay. Let's try Mushu. Probably about 80% better. Let's try chocolate. Still about 80%. Mm -hmm. okay. Doesn't matter. See, so now I, confessions of a bad, bad teacher, I don't remember which one Kiko says is supposed to do because I know that both do it. <laughs> so, but I know that according to Kiko, what, do, you, do you remember which one is supposed yeah. to be the... the um, Trochanter releases the wrong points. Okay. For the lung. And I'm telling you that Mushu does also. <laughs> yeah. you, you just saw that it's the yeah. truth. Yeah. So, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> How do you needle the trochanter? On the side, usually. Well, I was thinking, you know, it, if Mushu treats the Dantian, Dantian is the gate of inhalation and exhalation, right? Another word for dantian, yeah. another definition of dantian. Yeah. I'm just saying that, you know, sometimes certain points come a certain way and then, you know, you can figure out that they, there may be more to it. Yeah, you know, I mean, there may be other options. Mm -hmm. So, and I figured it in such a way that I forgot what the origin was. That was not a good thing. At least not what I'm teaching. And it's one thing to, to treat people. It's, it's another thing to teach. So know that it should be the trochanter. And what, did, what does trochanter mean? 
They're on the side, and you feel the choke hunter, you go in the front or in the back, usually more in the front or above, so you're surrounding the choke hunter. And it is going to be below Mushu. Mushu and choke hunter are not the same point. Okay? Okay. So, we'll just do the moxa on the immune, so we can, and then we'll turn you over and do the... I mean, the big deal, really what I wanted to show you is the insomnia point on the heel. So that's, we're going to have to turn her over, basically. And that's okay, because then we'll check out. So we just said that we must try to treat the Dantian. Mushu treat is part of Dantian treatment. Uh-huh. Right? Okay. Okay. So then, hold on, I need to find the box that we So Mushu is a way to come from the side. Instead of doing Ren4, if you have a problem in Ren4, you can do Mushu. Okay. And the trochanter is a different point. Trochanter is a good... <coughs> trochanter is good for ankles. It's good for um, intestinal stuff. And it's good for... Um, And apparently it's good for the, the thromboids. <laughs> the thing that's similar in both is that they have something to do with allowing, creating the space between the leg and the torso. So instead of you like, in both cases it allows the separation. Once you have the separation, the rest of the fascia in the abdomen, if you don't have a separation here, it's always crunched, the fascia in the abdomen is not going to have a chance to lengthen. Does that make sense? Yeah, so I'm that's what I think is common to both. I'm just thinking if that point would help with um, inducing labor because it's opening all of that, but you're saying it's pulling up. Oh, yeah. uh, I'm, I'm in an area where I'm totally... I know you're in... She does a piriformis for that. The, well, gallbladder 31, were, yeah, I mean, there's other things that, uh, you know. It's close yeah. by. But well, it's quite a bit lower, actually, but yeah, I, I, that, you, I'm, I know I'm out of my out league. Of territory. Yeah. It's not even territory, it's just, no. it's not my league. <laughs> I, no, 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 I, because it also means, first of all, well, I'm obviously not a doula, but I also don't do, uh, I'm not willing to be at people's beck and call. In, in that in this manner, you know, it, it requires a real dedication to the, to that field, you know, to be able to say yes, I'll be with you no matter when it happens. It's like no, you come in, this is your appointment. <laughs> you know, it's like you want to give birth at three o'clock, you can give birth at three o'clock. You, you know, but that's your appointment. You know, they do do that in the hospital. I know. I have a vacation to go to. That's absolutely correct. <laughs> So that's why, you know, labor is just not, um, no, it, it's a different field. That's, that's nothing to do with the kids. I mean, that's not, the kids up, up to age six, probably not part, part of my, the pregnant women are okay, fine. <laughs> the only thing about pregnant, you know, late pregnancy, the only problem is, can't lie on the table. Do you know how many pillows you have to crop for that? Sideways. Yeah, but then sideways, yeah, then I'm, I'm much more limited because I can't use the, I can only use one leg sometimes. So I prefer um, to, to have them, you know, to build up the bolsters and be able to, then I at least I have a full leg and a full arm, otherwise it's both sides, of, you know, side I do the back. If they're on the side, that, that would be my back treatment, but the truth is I'm, I've mostly done preeclampsia mm -hmm. for late pregnancy, uh, well, not that late, because they, you know. um, and I've done some trying to turn Women who come, you know, like they want that. And Are there any of these uh, regular PAs that you can do with the protocol points that are contraindicated? Sorry? In the protocols we've been introduced to so far, any of them contraindicated? Counterindicated for pregnancy? Uh, I don't think so. The stimulation is so mild. But, well, of course, you're not going to do Ren4 on someone. <laughs> you know, when they're pregnant. Um, you don't palpate lower abdomen when they're pregnant, even if it's just the first few weeks. 
Because you don't want them to say, oh, I miscarried because you poked on my belly. You know, I, it may, you could poke about, rent 12 about <coughs> time, not below. So your diagnosis is different. But in terms of points, I don't think it's a big deal. Make sure your stimulation is mild. You know, so since my needles are so much, sm sorry? No, no, no of course no pachi pachi. Mild <laughs> stimulation. Did you see how she jumped? <laughs> yeah. Go ahead. <laughs> no, you can use the pachi if they come for pain. Wait, wait, wait. They come for pain and you use the pachi with aluminum foil. That's okay, but not on a needle. No, no. Absolutely not in pregnancy. <laughs> I think my child is ADD is going to be a mild one. <laughs> it's like, my child has post-traumatic <laughs> disorder, and we, I don't understand why. <laughs> I've never been to Iraq. <laughs> what did I do? He's kind of electric. Sorry? He's kind of electric. <laughs> I have an electric kind of child. Electric fine. Electric fine. That's even better. <laughs> no, I'm sorry, but... Ali? Yes. I have a question. Um, yes. You mentioned that all asthma patients are going to have difficulty breathing out. So, so but, but they'll feel it differently. That's all I'm right. saying is that this concept that we have, breathing in, breathing out, which asthma do you have, is, is a feeling. It's not real. But when <coughs> they breathe, when they're not in an asthma attack, okay, also actually even when they're in an asthma attack, you're going to hear the <coughs> oh. And that's what kind of determines that. So there is something that's real about the breathing in and breathing out, and yet I'm just saying that scientifically, quote unquote, asthma is like you got expanded and you can't contract, contract the alveoli or whatever they're called in there, mm -hmm. can't come back to. to I, was, to I was just wondering about spleen issues for her because she has bunions. As yes, well. she does. I'm just curious <coughs> if, it, if you see any correlation. Well, if it was <coughs> exhalation problem, it would be a spleen for person. Okay, asthma. Inhalation is, it's either way, it's lung five. Kidney three for inhalation, spleen four for exhalation. Her spleen may be more related with the insomnia. Thank you. Third, well, she can turn with it. Okay. Let us turn you over. How's Ali? Um, Which one feels tight? One, two, three. 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 By the way, dry, okay. How's now? It doesn't really feel tight. Doesn't really feel tight, okay. And anything here? Yeah, that side feels more tender. That's more tender. Mm -hmm. Okay. Relax, relax, relax. How's that? Uh, still a little tender. Better. How much is left? Um, 30%. Hello? It's better. Hmm? It's gone. Gone. Can I have the injector? It's uh, in a lower shelf. There's a box. Oh. The injector. The, the Moxa box. Moxa box. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Just because I don't want to use this one. The needle injector. The injector. The needle injector. Yeah. <laughs> so insomnia point is in the middle of the heel. We used to say that the best point is the one when you press and the blood comes the slowest. It gains the, it gains the color the slowest. That's the best point to do. Now you can needle this point also, but it's ultimately a moxa point.
<laughs> That's an interesting way to measure points. Well, it used to be, you know, when you bent your finger where your finger landed. Really? It was many years ago. Oh, okay. So I've always heard center of the heel. So that's fine. So you're checking if the center of the heel is really where you bend your finger? Right. I think it depends on the shoe size. Mm -hmm. I mean, seriously. Yeah, totally. So. Now, this is a great point to practice your moxa because nobody cares. Yeah. Before we end, were you going to give the recipe for the shionka? Oh, that's, okay. Shionka recipe, okay. Um, one bottle of sesame oil. Best supposedly crude sesame oil unfiltered, or whatever it is. Raw. Raw, okay, well, thank you. Okay, and I believe it's a liter. Okay, it's, you bring it to, you have a number of ways to do it, so let me give you the ingredients first. Uh, 100 grams dungwei, um, Angelica sinensis. 100 grams zitsao gem, this is spermy, but must be gen. Don't get the stuff that looks like yin chen hao, okay? So, no, don't get the zitzau wrong, mm -hmm. the, the, the grassy part. You must have the, 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 the root of it, okay? So zitzau gen. You may add, that's the original recipe. You may add, if you like, other anti-burn um, or uh, generate flesh herbs. So for, I usually use diu, da wang, um, wang lian, or wang bai, um, teeny, uh, small amounts, I'll, I'll tell you about that. I, I, and then you can do, you know, maybe something generating, so like um, sheng di, you know, and you can even put wang chi, but I prefer, instead of that, I would put um, uh, uh, sun yao, the ascoria. Uh, you can put wang chi if you want, it's a, it's a flesh generating. Sang ji sheng is a flesh generating, so you choose. But whatever the herbs that you put, all of them together, cannot be more than what the zitzau or the dangwei, because those are the main herbs. Okay? So you have a few ways, and then you'll use uh, about 250 grams or so of uh, beeswax. Now when you, when, well, <laughs> yes. Um, okay, so here's a number of ways to do it. You can, you bring the oil to a boil, and you want to do it like, if you do it just for yourself, you'll have a supply for the next three lifetimes. Okay, mm -hmm. so, you know, just so you know, do it with other people so you can share. Okay, so bring the oil to a boil. Officially, what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to put the dangwei in a strainer. Now, you must use real pieces. Don't use powders, don't use, don't make them small, don't crumble them because then, it, you know, you get crumbly stuff in, in, the, in the cream. D dink the strainer into the oil, the warm oil. It's, now it's on a low flame. And it bubbles. And dink, dump, dink, you know. Dunk. Dunk, <laughs> dink, dunk, dunk, dunk. <laughs> um, a few times until there is no more bubbling. That's the dangwei done, gone. Throw the dangwei away. Then you take the zitzaugen and you put that dunk, dunk, dunk yeah. it in, yeah. and it goes. And you feel like the three witches of Macbeth. Okay? I mean, literally. And you do that a few times until it stops bubbling, it stops reacting. Then you can put your other herbs the same way in. Okay? Then. Turn the heat off. Pour the whole thing through a cheesecloth cloth because <coughs> some of the stuff still has, er some of the herbs will have gone through the strainer. Squeeze like hell, you know, to get as much of the liquid as you can. It's going to be very purple. Are you okay? Uh, yeah, I think I'm Oh, the, 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 the incense yeah. stick. Oh, I'm sorry. It's okay. Are you feeling anything, by the way? <laughs> Are you talking to me? <laughs> you woke her up, damn it. <laughs> I don't feel here. You don't feel here. Okay, no. let's make them bigger. So sometimes I don't use the pure gold mox on this because it's too expensive, because you're using bigger pieces. Also, I'm talking, so it's a little slower, so it's not a good thing. Um, you strain through a cheesecloth, and then you add 
you, start, you, you add the beeswax, melt the beeswax into it because it's still warm, and you put it in a pan and you keep stirring until it hardens. Don't let it harden without stirring. And then let it, it becomes a cream <coughs> and you're done. The other method is to just put the herbs in, but you always start with the dangwe, then the ditsaga, and then the other herbs if you're using any. And then this, you have to strain it and then put it through a cheesecloth. Either way, it doesn't really matter. But you're not really putting the herbs in there all too long. No, they're just so that they're reacting. When they stop reacting, it's, on the, it's, you still, um, it's still on heat when you put it on, on a low heat. So the dangwe doesn't react huge amounts, but it will react. The zitzau again will, you'll get, it will boil over sort of thing. Make them bigger. Are you feeling anything now? Not really. Sorry? Not really. <laughs> okay. You need to be covered up in cold now? Yeah, I am cold. Okay, I just felt heat. That was good. Which side? Uh, both sides. Though. Both sides, okay. They're, they're huge now. <laughs> Uh, pain in general, they can be very good for pain in general. It calms down the nervous system. Do you look at patients whose faces turn red after a treatment? treatment? Or is that a sign that the treatment's not the right treatment? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I'm trying to think you about mean it. When face, down? Okay. Uh, face up. Yeah. No, I don't believe it's ever happened to me. More than a rosy glow, you mean? Like red, red? I, mean, I, think I don't think I that's think what she means, rosy glow. Well, like I have a patient with chillblains, red hot toes, um, constipation, and migraines. And wait, wait, start again. What, what are the symptoms? Red hot toes, red chill hot blains. Toes. Chill, chill what? Chill blains. What's, what does that mean? Red hot toes. <laughs> red feels cold, They're though. swollen. But usually chill blains, it feels cold. Wait, right? is it like frostbite? They say, what does yeah. chill blain mean? No. Oh, he feels it's chilly? Not, no, 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 no. Okay. It's, they're not chills. Um, but the treatment can be heat to improve circulation, but it can also be cold. Because the, they're actually, it's the opposite of Raynaud's, which is cold, mm. white fingers and toes. Meaning, too, it gets flushes. Okay, got, got you. Swollen. Okay, thank hot you. And swollen okay, toes. got you. Okay. And, and it happens at the same time as constipation, which triggers a migraine. And this patient turns her face turns yes. red during the treatment. Yeah, I, I understand. Yeah, because it's a constrictor. Because what happens? Okay, what they even though it's the opposite of Reynolds, but it's almost the same as Reynolds in yes. a way because it's actually a constriction of the blood vessels, but it's constricting it apparently in such a phase. Yeah. Yeah. So it's the same as Reynolds. It's a, because it's yeah. Uh, first of all, is it a he or she? She. She. Have you tried UV sixty six? Maybe estrogen. I may have. Okay. She's an adrenal type and ANS type. Okay. Uh, I would say what happens is because as you're opening blood vessels in one place, you know, you're creating a circular, new circulatory issue that's kind of like and familiar to the body. Right. So that that would be my sense. Uh -huh. What you what I would do is add stomach chi to your treatment, uh -huh. and see if that reduces the redness. Mm -hmm. that's Not guaranteeing, right. but it's right. a possibility. You still feeling a little bit? Because mm -hmm. otherwise I'll be like, Kiko, I'll put the damn thing on you. <laughs> <laughs> Someone asked about Naroma. Holly just had, can I tell what yeah, yeah, her treatment was? She said the treatment she likes the best for Naromas is to slide up the shin till you find a tender Stomach spot. The, I think she was doing the yes, inner. Oh, yeah. inner. Inner. Mm. And then you do direct moxa. On and like on number five or wherever it would be mm -hmm. that kind of feeling, okay. mm -hmm. huh. and you do a lot of direct knots on that point. She says it works very well for Nora. What are you finding? What? Are you finding a nodule or a tender spot? Like, like yeah, in my bone, opinion, it would have been stomach. You're sure it's on the on inner? The bone. On the bone. Are you sure yeah. it wasn't stomach too? It was okay. on the inner. Okay. Yeah. Like liver channel. Okay, I think that would be enough is, since you... Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. 
All right. Just put it in the carpet. Just put it in the carpet. It goes right out. No, no, I'm sure right. it does. It's okay, it's no big deal. All right. I think she's asleep. <laughs> 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 so sorry, would you mind sleeping somewhere else? <laughs> <laughs> what time is it? 4.35. 4.35. One more person. Quickly. Yes, <laughs> no, the other person quickly. Okay. You always left side? No, both sides. Both sides, okay. Like it's both sides today. Thyroid conditions in the family? No. Anything else in your medical history? Allergies. Allergies? Ah, okay. Something. And pulse. Okay. <laughs> Almost everyone who got on the table had very high pulse. I'm, I'm, I'm telling you, this is a relatively last 10 year phenomenon. Okay. It's a GMO phenomenon. It's a what? Mm. Oh, oh, GMO. <laughs> One. Thank you. Thank you. Three. Anything? Do you see it more in the spring? The red nine holes? Yeah. Mm, I don't think so. What are you checking with these? Or what are the you nasal. Addressing? Because nasal allergies. Oh, nasal allergies can allergies. create this. She says like this. So okay. could be glandular problem. Okay, one, two, three. Barely, but three probably okay. most. Um, okay, how about you don't like this, right? I okay. feel it a little bit. You probably okay. have to press harder. I uh, you know, because then it's. Oh, really? Yeah, that's. There, I feel a little bit. Here? How about here? Here? There. Ah, there, okay. Is that Let's see if it's. Uh, no, uh, no, it's behind. Uh, it's not quite cervicals, but it's further lateral. So, hold on. So, this. Let's see if it can from the nose. A little bit better. I would How say 50%. 50%, okay. So when they say a little bit, you don't know. Everybody's a little bit is different. Mm -hmm. How's now? 70. 70. Is there a movement with a neck that you that is uncomfortable for you? Yes. Which one? If I turn to the side. Which side hurts? This side? Both, but the Both. side's more. Which is this side? The left? Left side's okay. more. Anything to you? A little bit of that A little one. bit? Okay. I hardly felt it to the end of it. Okay, but it's better. Yeah. Hardly to nothing is something. <laughs> Avi, are you um, just helping just any general area of the neck, which specifically? Yeah, because, no, no, I'm not diagnosing right now. I mean, okay. I remember, these are fast cases, and we really don't have time in yeah. a particular situation. So. Scalings, SEL. No, I was just looking for where is the pain okay. in her Got case. It. Okay. Turn your head again. How's now? I still feel it. Okay, relax. One, now this is the SEM. One, two, three. Two and three. Two and three. Three? Uh, maybe 20% better. Okay. Three? Same. Okay, let's see, pulse. I wouldn't say rapid, but just for the sake of it. Hi. What? I don't feel it. Hmm? I don't feel it. You don't feel it. Okay. You have to say. <laughs> <laughs> I am not a mind reader.
three. Sanja, five, yes. Yeah. Two and three, three being worse. Okay. Three? Uh, 50%. Better. Okay. Seventy. Does she have rapid calls or by release? In my opinion, no. I would, I, I, that's when Sanja 8 didn't work, I was thinking maybe she has rapid calls and I wouldn't call it rapid. How's the name? I still feel it when I turn. Okay. Fully feel it, somewhat better, you know, uh, it's okay. 30, 25, 30. Sorry? 25% improvement. Okay, that's something. Okay. How's now? That's better. How much better? Uh, 60%. 60%. Okay, we'll take. Sold. Sorry. I know, I'm not because it must try to fight. Okay. Yeah, I hear. Sorry. No change at all. No change. Okay, that's fair. So all together, how much percentage better at this point? Fifty. Fifty. Okay. Anything here? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. How's now? I would say it's better. I don't feel it. Okay. Turn your head. It probably added another 10, 15 percent. Okay. Maybe the other side will give us a little 66. Because she has GB20, around GB20. So, so, you know, this is not the best diagnosis method, obviously. But I did see something on her that I wanted to deal with. You're a little puffy here. Is there a thyroid issue in the family? I don't have any. Okay. There's diabetes. But you asked thyroid. <laughs> yeah, 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 no, no, no. I didn't ask any. I didn't even ask you for medical history. It's okay. Yeah. I'm just going, oh, shoot. <laughs> okay. Anything here? It's usually tender, but I don't feel it. Nick. No change at all. No change. Okay. If you say to me, I don't feel it. No change. <laughs> doesn't, yeah. Sorry, it no change. really doesn't mean anything to me. Okay. No. That helped me. I would say I would help. I could do it. 70% better? Better. Big change. Okay. OD. Okay. But I, so we have to ask ourselves, how come spleen 3 did not help? Okay, something's, it's, it's supposed to be good friends. Now. didn't take it away, I still feel about 20%, 10%. Right. 20 or 10, oh, so it's so better it than without? Is it doing something is the question. Do you, do you understand what I'm saying? I don't think it's doing anything. You don't think it's doing anything, okay, fine. What was that, what you were to? Stomach chi. Oh, okay. Happens to be a friend of spleen three. So I thought, well, maybe there's a way to, okay, go ahead, Nick. It's okay, it's what, just, no. No. Okay, fine. It's no big deal. <laughs> I don't care. I mean, I do care, but... Well, that's why we don't treat with just tricks. I understand, but yeah. the point for the, of this is, is to I trick. I know, sure, but I'm yeah. telling her, not yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How's that? No. Okay. Mm -hmm. No problem. 
remember great point for the neck, but I, I have to do it because I won't be able to turn with her. So this thyroid point. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. That actually helped a little. Oh. It helped. I mean, I still feel it if I try to turn it. I could like press it. Hold on. Hold on. Come towards me. Very nice. Okay, come back. Okay. Cool. Try again. Where are we at? I only have 10% of it left. 10% No. Give me three. Same. Same. Okay, fine, 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 fine. Any pain, give me two. I felt that on the left. And you, okay. Now. Still 10. No, no change in other words. I mean, I, I'm doing it to like, I'm straining myself to turn that way and it still hurts. Okay. Do you know what I mean? Like. Well, if I strain myself, it will hurt me too. <laughs> so I'm, I'm a little confused. No, because usually people say, I'm going all the way and, you know, it, and it still hurts versus people say, well, it used to hurt here and now it hurts here. So I'm, I'm not sure well, what you're saying. I think I'm comparing it to when I'm upright versus okay. when I'm laying on bed. Relax. Relax. No, 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 no. Oh, you're going up your arms. <laughs> you're upright. It's okay, don't worry. Okay, compare. I feel it. How how's how's come before? Um, I'd say forty percent. Okay, relax. Look to the left, not too far. Just a little. Okay, now look to the right. Breathe and slowly. So, were you here yesterday? Okay. Do you remember I did that on someone? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> slowly yeah. to the right. I just assumed you knew what I was going to do. Yeah. Keep on going. That doesn't matter if it hurts. Keep on going. No, no, she, she's far enough. Just, just breathe now. Okay, good girl. Keep your head there and now go to the other side. Left. Slowly. Good, 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 good. Don't overdo it. Okay, try the neck now. Oh, it's a lot better. It's like 10% now, really. Fabulous. Um, <laughs> Do you, do you, did you get the, um, the sausage? No. The sausage? <laughs> do you like cows? I don't eat beef very often. That's very good. Do you like cows? I didn't ask about beef. Cows? Do you like cow? In what way? <laughs> do you think they're cute? <laughs> it doesn't matter. It's a stupid question. It's a San Francisco. I mean, it's a Why? What I like it? them. They're cute. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay, I'm afraid you might feel like one. <laughs> That's why. Oh, is that why? <laughs> like a cattle prod. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. It's okay. It's okay. Are you have to understand. I used to have a. I used to have a clinic. I used to have a clinic in a castro. What can I say? Okay. Turn your head slightly to the right. Slightly. That's good enough. Relax. The muscle will jump. It does not feel happy. You can tell me stop at any moment. It, it will last three to five seconds at the most, even if you don't tell me to stop. So don't worry. Some people can't take it. It's okay. But we'll just try. Here we go up. You don't care. Yeah, this is, this is stuck here. Because otherwise it should jump more. Okay. Uh, turn to the right. To the left, sorry. To the left. To the left. left. Okay, good. Not so much, just not. This one's responding more, you see? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So now turn, are you okay? Are you sure? Just slightly to the right. Slightly to the right, quite some pleasant. Ah, better, okay. Oh, I'm getting a better reaction, okay, excellent. How's the neck now? Is that the little pachi like an Easton machine, pretty much? Like, no? 
It's like an oven sparker to light your gas stove. So if I do this, this hurts. Okay, fine, 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 fine. fine. What about rotation to the side? Is better? Some mechanical rubbing of two metal parts. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. What is this chain called? The chain's called a silver chain. <laughs> <laughs> you can, but it has diodes on it. Does but it you can literally do it with any that chain, honestly. Does it still feel at that level? I haven't. That's like. You're really just pressing the new term. You said you felt much better. Oh, yeah, that I felt. Are you still feeling? Do you want the chain to be about that thickness? It doesn't matter. It can be very fine too. Oh uh, no, not too fine. That's yeah. Good. The thing about you can use a regular I don't chain, feel that pain but the diodes are better. And if you use regular chain, I'd actually recommend stainless yeah, steel. Because my preferred she, stainless steel. Uh, oh. Rotate is different. She, she, she uses a different vertebra to, to rotate. Yeah. She goes, she looks up and then rotates, and then that hurts. That's right. Fine. You asked me about manual. You ask me about manual things. I know because okay. I have Can you lie down face up? <laughs> Again? You yes. Have lie down face up. Yeah, it's okay. You're, you can lie. Okay. So now it's bringing, it's doing this right now. That's a problem, right? Can you do it? Just so we just. Okay, relax. On the scapula out? Yeah. Relax. <laughs> You're just kind of like waiting for something to happen. Nothing will happen. Oh no, I'm just relaxing. Oh. <laughs> 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 Oops, sorry. Honestly, I can raise the shoulder blade if I want. I'm in control, not you. <laughs> okay. Go ahead, sit up and tell me how to do Making faces doesn't mean anything well, to me. I don't, I don't, that. <laughs> I don't, don't, don't. I understand. It's okay. Not your fault. Okay. So. Uh, can you test easily lying down or easily, easily uh, sitting up? Which is easiest? I can try to do it when I'm lying down. Which one was clearer? Uh, when I'm up. When you're sitting. Okay. So I'd rather do that. We'll take this away. Sorry, no. I would say that's 30% better. Lift this arm up. Thank you. You can let go of the arm. Okay, now. Oh. Oh. Yeah, that would can be. Can I have a needle 80%. in a guide tube? 80. Can you put a needle in a guide tube for me? Is that, is that heart one? This is way below heart. No, this is gallbladder 22. Mm -hmm. In my opinion. <laughs> that is what? What do you call that? Gallbladder 22. Okay. Oh. Well, you need to put the handle in first. <laughs> <laughs> That's my problem. <laughs> That's the problem. Yeah. Gallbladder 22. Do you need a little posterior? Hold on. I don't know why. I was thinking GB26. I, I, I knew something in the side. That's all I knew. You can let the arm down. Is you can let the arm down on top of me. It's okay. Relax. <laughs> She's under third toe tight. They can't relax. Okay. Try now. It's okay. Where are we at? Don't be disappointed. Just tell me. I think that gave me a 40% miss. What about the rotation? Rotation's good.
with my needle. Go for it. Relax the arm into my into my hand. Let the arm go. Yes, yes. Do you feel tightness and yeah, it's I don't know what Cory is. But <laughs> don't speak that language. Okay. No, sorry, but how's your neck? I mean the same from where we were before. Yeah. 60% of that. One more? Two? And last one. It stays the same? It stays the same. It's okay. How much now? Okay, good, good, good. Now? Um, I would say 70%. I don't know what you call it. it doesn't really <laughs> Why does everybody try and put the needles in with not, with not to handle first? I can't see this. <laughs> you can't see it. <laughs> One more. Sorry. Yeah. Oh, no more. I have to Are sure? That's it? fine. No worries. Oh, you know what? Give me a yellow stereo. No, no, no. Give me a yellow. You opened it already? Yeah, it looks like a Is the point the release of the nails? No, no, no problem. No, no. Try your head. 70%. Okay, one more. Go. Small just nine ten. I would say I'm almost there. Shoot. One more. <laughs> no, I'm, now I'm getting competitive. <laughs> it's me against the hundred percent. It's okay. I'll, 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 if you want to come back next week. I'm not here next week. <laughs> how's she going to tell me? To, how's she going to come back? If it doesn't get, it doesn't get better. Do you feel schmutz there? Oh, I feel schmutz. Now, now you understand why this method does not do well. <laughs> you need to do the body first, yeah, yeah. and then yeah. chase the symptom. Don't yeah. chase up, up, up front. 90%. Okay, now she can come back next week. <laughs> and what do you call this guy? I I'm would sure. call it large intestine 14 years. Okay. <laughs> On the triple warmer channel. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> okay. Sanjao Asher. Sanjao Asher. Yeah. I, this is no rhyme or reason for this. This is like re really, it's just like you're searching and sort of going, well, where is it going to be? You know. Did you All right. the rib cage thing? No, I no. didn't. Would you? Would I? Maybe, maybe, maybe it's sure? this can it's settle sure. down because, yeah, yeah, it could be. It certainly could be, yeah. All right, so we're going to end here in all likelihood, because there's no, no, because it's five o'clock, right? Five of three. Five of three, okay. So thank you so much for coming. I realize. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so, <laughs> so next time I have to find a new trick. <laughs> okay. So no, no, I, I realize, you know, I haven't, I have not taught in San Francisco for over seven years, so, you know, it's like, you, you have no idea, you know, if, if I can still teach, you know, so it's very kind that you came. Um, and really, I encourage you to use what you can in any way you can. You know, there is no, there are no, um, proprietorships on this. There's no secrets in this. You just, we each do what we can. That's all there is to it. And again, if you want, email me. Um, if you want, uh, if there are people who want to create a group together and study, you know, let me know. I'll be happy, you know, as long as my, my only condition is 10 people minimum. Because there's no energy with less than, I, I, when I teach with less than people, I'm exhausted at the end of it, because I have to hold it. But if you want, I'm happy to, you know, um, and I'm also saying to you, go go out there and do it. It's not like you have to wait for some certificate from me or from Kiko or from anyone else to say you know the style. You know, 
in my experience, I know lots of people who teach this, teach this and practice, you know, very few people practice quote unquote exactly Kiko style, including myself. Okay, because the style itself is all about make it, do something, mix it up and do something, make whatever works for it. Okay, so don't be afraid, just dive straight in. Okay, that's really, really my best advice to you. Don't, you know, and that's why I, t I teach you make it up, make it up. Because to teach, I can teach you the protocols, but then you'll be afraid. You know, you, I know you'll be afraid anyway. But this way, you've seen that the protocols are not the most important thing. Okay, if you think there's a protocol for everything, you're wrong. Okay, there really isn't. There isn't a better protocol by someone else. There might be. The only thing there is is how, can you think? Can you can you get excited about what's happening? And can you trigger? Can you, can you just keep keep finding out? That's keep how the inquiring. protocols get created. Yeah, it's true. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. So that's what I, I want you know. So remember, the basis of the method is medical history, abdominal findings. Prioritize what you found and figure out a 